Jata Libra Doskia, Rasa Kete Libra Gata Gate Letronde, Rasa Kata Libra Gade, Jata Libra Gadosio, Ra Ata Kate Lepre Itizana, Estotro Gedashte. I must draw from my open wells. I must draw from my open wells. I must draw from my open wells. Nothing will hinder me this year. Nothing will hinder my family this year. Nothing will hinder my family this year. Nothing will hinder my children this year. Nothing will hinder my life this year. Nothing will hinder my wife this year. Nothing will hinder my ministry this year. We must draw from the open wells. We must draw from the open wells. Nothing, oh Lord. We receive the grace for drawing. We receive the strength for drawing. We receive the spirit for drawing. We receive the strategy for drawing. We receive the structure for drawing. We receive the system for drawing. We must draw from the open wells. We must draw from the open wells. Open fountains of grace. Open fountains of revelations. Open wells of realities. Open, open wells of increases. In the name of Jesus, every well that the Lord has reopened for us, we must draw from them. In the name of Jesus, Masekete lebregadosia, Rakata katali bregadosia, Rante te te keli gabaradiza, Eruapa katendro godosia, Rante ketoro gradisata, Rabakata titori adakasata, Rate kete lebregadosia. In 2023, I must draw from the open wells. I must draw from my reopen wells. I must draw from the reopen wells of relationships. In the name of Jesus. What is the benefit of reopening a well that I cannot draw from? What is the blessing of reopening a well that I cannot draw from? What is the essence of reopening a well that I cannot draw from? My Father, in the name of Jesus, I make up my mind this year that every well that has been reopened for me, I will draw from them. Give me the system. Give me the impact. The, the influence, give me the direction, give me the strength, give me the grace, give me the ideas to draw from my wells, the wells of grace, the wells of glory, the wells of the Spirit of God, in the name of Jesus, Mareba Shatagada. Rekata kada gabarata, reba ba 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 da, mashekete libra gada gada, rekete kete libra gada gada, rante de de bregedoso, rapa kata gida la bregedosha, rata kata la bregedosio, rapa ita gada la bregedosio. I must draw, I must draw, I must draw from the wells, from the wells, from the wells that I have reopened, the wells that have been reopened, the wells that have been reopened. I must draw from them. My life must be watered this year as I draw. As I draw. I came to draw. I came to draw this year. I arrived this year to draw from wells. Fountains. Fountains. Inner fountain of my spirit. Inner fountains of my spirit. From the wells of angels. From the wells of the Holy Spirit. From the wells of men. I must draw from wells this year. In the name of Jesus. Jesus, Father, I begin to pray that my eyes be open to the things I need to use to draw from wells this year. Open my heart to the understanding of the things I need to use to draw from my wells. In Jesus' name, we draw from our open wells. Amen. This is our year of the will of God. Amen. Where there are people to pray. There is the living God to answer them. Precious saints of God, I want to welcome you to today's midday intercession and prophetic prayers. The wells must be reopened. The wells must be reopened. The wells must be reopened. Every well that we make you to flourish this year must be reopened. Every well that must make your ministry to flourish must be reopened. Every well that must make your life joyful must be reopened. And you must draw from those wells in the name of Jesus. 
Precious saints of God, I want to welcome you today. I thank God that God is giving us direction early enough. Hear me. There was dryness in the land of Gira. And Isaac sowed in that same land, that same year of famine and drought. And he harvested a hundredfold. Every time I read that scripture, I keep wondering, how? And God said, because of the wells of Abraham from where he was drawing and watering his fields. Did you see the secret? Isaac was drawing and watering his fields from the wells his father dug. And the Philistines found the secret of his prosperity, the wells. Listen to me. If your wells are connected to the subterranean waters, it does not matter the level of dryness. If you are willing to draw, your life will be watered. I have seen a lot of gardens flourishing in the middle of dry season. Why? There is a well from where the owners of the gardens are drawing from and watering their field. So Isaac was drawing and watering the fields. And today, we want to pray that God, we must draw from our wells. We must draw from our wells. I want you to know that it is useless to have a well you cannot draw from. It is absolutely useless to have a well you cannot draw from. The beauty of a well is that it exists for you to tap into it and take from what it is inside the waters and bring them to the surface for your benefit. If you cannot pull the waters in a well from the depth, you cannot receive the blessings of that water. If a well is existing and you don't know how to draw from it, you will not be blessed by the waters of the wells. There are many of us, our wells are not closed. We have the wells of the spirit of God, the wells of angels, the wells of our spiritual fathers, the wells of wonderful friends who are so blessed but we don't know how to draw from the wells. This day our prayer is that God will give you all the systems, all the strategies, all the structures, all the skills. Everything you need to deploy to take the waters from the wells to the surface. Listen, there is no beauty, no blessing in laboring to open wells you cannot draw from. The Bible said in verse 15 of Genesis chapter 26, the Bible said that they closed up the wells because they found the secret. And in verse 18, the Bible said, Isaac digged again. We have asked for strength to dig. We have asked for the reopening of the wells. But this morning we want to draw. Let us look at the book of um, Isaiah. Isaiah chapter 12. Verse number 3. Isaiah 12 verse 3. Therefore with joy shall you draw water. Out of the wells. Wells, not well. Listen, wells of salvation. Let me give you a secret. When God brought you into the saving grace of Christ, there were wells he made available for you. But Isaiah said, if you don't have the joy, remember the joy of the Lord is, is my strength. Nehemiah chapter 8 verse 10. The joy of the Lord is my strength. If you are not joyfully drawing, you cannot joyfully enjoy. Any believer you see that is enjoying the mysteries of God and of Christ is that believer that has known how to draw from wells. Listen, 
Let me say this to you. There are creative men and women that God has placed around you. But they will never be a blessing to you if you don't know how to draw from them. There are spiritual fathers that God has placed around you. There is a wonderful husband, a wonderful wife, precious children, wonderful leaders and ministers in your ministry, awesome neighbors, glorious people that God placed around you. They are wells. Let me say this. Excuse me. Every man you meet in life is a well. He's carrying some heavy water that you need. Every man God permits you to meet in life is a well. Every man is a well. If you reopen relationships, you receive revelations on how to draw. There are many of us that are struggling today because we just don't know how to draw from the men and women, from the circumstances and situations, from the beautiful ideas and innovations and information and, and intuitions and influences. That God had placed all around us. Notice. I want to show you something in the book of John chapter 4. And we will begin to pray. John chapter 4 verse 11. A very deep statement. That the woman of Samaria made to Jesus. Then the woman said unto Jesus. Sir, thou hast nothing to draw with. And the well is deep. The woman stated two things. Two things, two facts about wells. Many wells are deep. And he said to Jesus, you have nothing to draw with. Is this us? Is the woman talking to somebody this afternoon? You want a blessing from this year, yet you have nothing to draw with from the year. Your man of God declared this year to be your year of prosperity, your year of harvest, your year of the will of God, your year of increase, your year of double portion. Yet you have nothing to draw with. How are you going to enjoy this year if you don't have anything to draw with from these prophecies that have been made over your life? How are you going to experience the watering of your life from these prophetic wells of decree, from this decree made from prophetic wells? How are you going to be blessed? Your bishop prophesied to you, your apostle prophesied to you, your prophet prophesied to you, your pastor declared it, that it is your year of glory. Yet this year can end like every other year if you don't have anything to draw with. This year, you will have enough to draw with. Yeah. Hear me, precious saints of God. It does not matter how beautiful the waters in the well is. If you don't have anything to draw with, you will not enjoy the waters. Now hear me as I, as I begin to lead you in prayers. I was asking the Lord then, what about drawing? He said, there are two systems of drawing. Two systems for drawing water from a well. He said there is a manual system. A manual system where you use bucket and rope and keep drawing and drawing. He said but that system can lead to stress. It can lead to fatigue. It can lead to breakdown. It can lead to weakness. It can lead to tiredness. It can lead to weariness. He said that system does not sustain continuous drawing. This year you need continuous drawing. He said the second system after manual system is the mechanized advanced system. Hey, The system where you take pipes and pumping machine and a generator 
and throw the pipe to the depths of the wells and start your generator. And suddenly, tanks and tanks and tanks are getting filled up while you are relaxing. May God give you mechanized system for drawing this year. Advanced system. Advanced system. So our prayer is basically, oh God today, I am not just asking you for just a mere manual system for drawing. There are systems of well called revelation. There are systems called relationship. There is a system called rest. There is a system called revelation. There are systems. Listen, all these things are wells you need to draw from this year. There is a well of reproduction. God wants you to reproduce your kind. You will draw from that well. So can you say, my father, my father. In the name of Jesus. I must draw from my wells this year. I must draw from my wells this year. I must draw from my wells this year. Give me the ideas. Give me the influence. Give me the impartation. Give me the revelation. Give me the information with which I must draw this year. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Give me the ideas this year. This year was no waste for me. This year will not waste for me. Abba Father, in the name of Jesus, I receive the influence. I receive the ideas. I receive the information. I receive the impartation. I receive the impact. I receive the intuition. I receive the innovation. I receive the grace. I receive the systems. I receive in my spirit today the strategies. The strategies. The divine strategies. The divine structures. The divine skills with which I am going to draw this year. In the name of Jesus, I receive by the spirit of God in the name of Jesus the skills that I need this year the skills that I need this year the strategies that I need this year the skills that I need this year the spirit oh Lord I need the spirit of drawing I need the spirit of drawing my spirit must not be weak I must not be weary this year I must not be discouraged. I must not be drafted, drifting aside. I must not drift from my focus this year. Etaba, ayata gaba, erikata kata, rekata gadaya. Teach me, teach my hands uh, the skills for drawing this year. Teach my hands uh, the skills for drawing this year. My harvest of hundredfold must come in the midst of the dryness. Uh, my garden must be watered uh, from the wells. Uh, my gardens must be watered. Uh, your gardens must be watered. Uh, your family must be watered. Uh, that ministry must be watered. Rekaba uh, gada gada. Rakashata bada, rekete kete, haria badia, ashata gata, rekete kwa, haria kadata, radosi yata, mandre tegaba, ashata kata, erua kadinta, reba atenia, esketerian, askin dorobodo, yoko kiki gaga, eri kiki gaga, aliante toniodo, ariba katena, asketoro kadiata, erua papa papa. Give me somebody that must help me to draw this year. All the people, all the people, all the people that we help me draw in this year. I ask for their connection this year. They must connect to me. They must connect to me. All the revelation that I need to draw. All the relationships that I need to go. In the name of Jesus, I begin to receive them. Rako Shakadaya. All the skills, all the strategies, all the skills, all the strategies, all the skills, all the strategies, all the skills, all the systems, all the structures, whoever I need to synergize with in order to draw this year in the name of Jesus, I connect to them. I receive the structures, I receive the strategies, I receive the spirit, I receive the skills, I receive, I receive. 
receive the strength. I receive the stamina. I receive the stamina. I receive the stamina to be able to draw this year. I will not be wasted this year. I will not be wasted this year. This 2023, I am drawing. I am drawing. I am drawing from my wells of salvation. From the wells of salvation. From the wells of healing. From the wells of deliverance. From the wells of fruitfulness. From the wells of increase. Arapakataka. Ajakatakata. Rakatabadaya. Rekekekekeketa. Eloa tamba. Eloa tamba. Ajateketeria. Rakatagadaya. Masakataragadaya. This year will not be wasted for me. In Jesus' name we draw. Amen. This is our year of the will of God. Amen. The will of God for you this year is that all the wells of your salvation, you must draw joyfully from all of them. Amen. See this year, saints of God, God is giving us deep revelation. Because a lot of us have not known, why is it that my year, I will pray. Listen, prayer is good. But when you finish praying, ask the Lord to give you the passion to pursue. Give you the passion, the power to pursue the direction you have prayed. You cannot be praying and be sitting one place. No. You are asking God for increase in your ministry. Ask God to give you the strength to go for evangelism. Ask God to give you the strength to go on radio. Ask God to give you the financial strength to go and begin to do what you have to do that will draw the people. That will draw the people. We are going to pray again. Lord, my father, my father, I do not need a manual strategy. I need a mechanized advanced strategy. The pipes and the machines and the generators for continuous drawing. Open your mouth and pray. Say, Lord, manually this year. I will not draw manually this year. I need a mechanized advanced system this year. Advance my ideas. 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 Give me advanced information. Information. Give me advanced information. I am ready to advance. I am ready to advance. I am ready to advance. I am tired of this place. Why sit we here until we die? Why sit we here until we die? In Deuteronomy chapter 1, verse 6, the word of God said, You have dwelt long enough on this mountain. I have dwelt long enough on this manual level, on this manual level of drawing. Lord, in the name of Jesus, call Connect my spirit to the advanced level of drawing, to the mechanized level of drawing from the wells in the name of Jesus. Mechanize my spirit. Oh Lord, advance my spirit. Advance my thought. Advance my imagination. Advance my reasoning. I need advanced level. Advanced level of strength. Advanced level of strategies. Advanced level of skills. Oh Lord, in the name of Jesus, I am willing, oh God, to be trained. I am willing to be taught. I am willing to be directed. I am willing to be instructed. I am willing to be imparted with ideas and information. I need innovations and intuitions. I need instruction from the Holy Ghost. I need angelic instructions. I need angelic instructions. I need angelic instructions. I need heavenly instructions. I need heavenly impartation. Advanced impartation. Advanced impartation. Advanced influence. Asa katakaba ya katagada elwa shada elwa shada ba eleketa gada bosha lekata kata rabara bara yeketa gada bosha ragada gada bosha repa pa 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 ya maseketa gada bosha ragada gada ragada ya rekete kete rebra repa pa 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 ya this year I will think in a higher level. I raise up my thought processes. I cause my mind to gain ascendancy this year in thinking. My thoughts are higher thoughts. They are no lower thoughts. I reject 
reject those lower thoughts. I reject those lower imaginations. I reject those lower aims. I, I, I gain advantage. I gain advancement. I gain increase by the Holy Ghost. From the waters I draw this year, my ministry shall be watered. From the waters I draw this year, my family shall be watered. My future shall be watered. My health shall be watered. Oh, shakata kataya. Ya shata katara kataya. I draw and water my field. I draw and water my life. I draw and water my health. I draw and water my health. My health is watered. My health is watered. My bones are watered. My blood is watered. My body is watered from the wells of salvation. As I am drawing, I water every member of Kingdom Kings Church. All the men of God connected to my life. I say they are watered. Everyone sitting under the sound of my voice, you are watered you are watered no more dryness no more barrenness no more dryness no more barrenness araka pataya e jakatarada e rikatagataya i draw this year i came into this year to draw i came to draw i came to draw i came to draw everyone that is connected to me i draw from them i draw idea from them i draw inspiration from them i draw energy from them i draw strength from them i draw grace from them i draw glory from them i draw goodness from them i draw financial ideas i draw boldness i draw depths of secrets from them in the name of jesus in jesus name we draw this is our year of the will of god amen Precious saints of God. As we close today's prayers. You know I told you. That our prayer is 30 minutes. And I want to keep to that 30 minutes. Every day. I don't want to exceed it. Because we will continue to pray. But go home and begin to cry out. Say God. The ideas. The information, the intuition, the innovation, the influence that I need. Advanced influence. Advantageous influence. The impact that I need. Listen, there are certain wells you cannot draw from until there is an advanced impact you are making. If you begin to impact nations, you will begin to draw the resources of nations. If you impact nobody, you draw no resources. This year, that very sponsorship you are asking for, God will give you the influence and the impact to draw in the name of Jesus. Precious saints of God, I want to stretch my hand and pray for the prayer points on the table of altar of prayers. Father, all the prayer points listed in these prayers, I begin to pray that the hand of the Lord, the waters of salvation, will begin to flow upon each point and bring answers in the name of Jesus. Let healings take place. Let deliverances take place. Let that very body be delivered. Let that family be given children. Let there be opening of doors of businesses. Let the waters of God flow for you in the name of Jesus. This year you shall have testimonies. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Amen. Listen, my duty is not just to pray for you. My duty is to teach you how to pray. How to pray and get answers. That's what we are doing. And thank God for today. Tomorrow will come your way again. But I have a few announcements to make. Tonight, I will be for the first time this year on air, on radio station, from 5.30 to 6 Central African time. But you can listen to that station from anywhere in the world. Anywhere in the world. From anywhere in the world, you can listen to that station. You can listen to that station from anywhere in the world. And I want you to know 
Somebody can copy that link, the link to the app, and place it on the comment section. Uh, copy it from our WhatsApp group or from anywhere and place it on the comment section. Now you can, if you are using Android phone, you can use your Android to connect, to, to download the app by 5.30 from anywhere in the world, U.S., United Kingdom, the Netherlands, anywhere, Sweden, you can join us. And today, I want to speak. Um, it, throughout the night, I was asking the Lord, what do I share? He said, positioned in my will. And today, God will position you in his will to punish his enemies. Every enemy following you like Pharaoh, God will position you before the Red Sea and drown them. I tell you, he will position you to possess what is rightfully yours. I want you to join us by 5.30 p.m. Nigerian time or Central African time. And remember that where there are people to pray, there is the living God to answer them. I will see you again tomorrow, 12 noon Central African time. Please keep sharing this uh, link. Share it to your family. Share it to everybody. And reach out to all the people that used to be part of Midday Prophetic Prayers and tell them to join again. The midday prophetic prayer is back, well, and alive. I remain your beloved Apostle Steve OKK. God bless you. Bye-bye. Flow through